Hi everybody, it's Kayla, and welcome back to Fixer Upper, the show where I usually attempt to fix up your houses, but today, do poor little Johnny Zest's house, because let's be honest, the guy isn't my favorite sim, but he deserves not this, <laughs> you know? Um, it's, a, it's an unfortunate looking place, okay? We get it. Uh, and I renovated it today, because I mean, I mentioned in the video, like the later voiceover, but he just, it's bad and he needs help, and then we're gonna get around to it if I don't do it now, so... <laughs> Here we go, uh, but it's small, so there's not much to tour. As you can see, the outside looks like this. I actually placed these trees myself um, for my Simsy save. They don't actually exist. I just felt like the lot looked kind of empty, so I filled it up. Usually, the lot looks. Hold on, I'll show you. Looks like this when you. Well, there's not all. Well, <laughs> there's not terrain paint there when you download the when you like open the game. But it looks like this. It's very sad and sad. <laughs> so here's the outside. I like the gnomes and stuff, but it just it's kind of weird looking and can use some help, you know? When you first walk in, um, well also this looks like it's too high, so that's an issue in itself. But when you first walk in, um, it's just kind of dark in here for one, uh, and it, I don't know, I feel like it fits the style well because it looks like he's got like a weird collection of random furniture, you know? Um, and it's kind of dumpy, which is intentional, but like we have this god awful small kitchen <laughs> with these weird green appliances and they clash, it all clashes. Um, I hate this, this light, a lot. Um, cool dinosaur clock though. And then just small windows, we it random color scheme, weird blue carpet. I don't know, the whole place is pretty random. In here is the bathroom. It's all very dark, you know? And then in here is his bedroom, which is super weird because he only has a single bed, which is weird to me because I, f I don't know, he's got space for a double bed. Why do you only have, I don't understand. And like he's covered half of the windows with these curtains. I don't, I just, it's all again, very dark, which is an issue and small and poorly furnished, and just weird. So I wanted to fix it. And so I kind of did. Um, I, I went a little bit out there with the furnishing. You'll see it when I do the, when I do the renovation, but I'm excited to show it to you. And so with that being said, let's go ahead and jump right on in to the renovation. Okay, so we are back and we are fixer uppering this house or trailer thing. Sorry, Johnny Zest, I don't know. You guys, usually I do a house that you build in case you didn't, I mean, you probably knew this already. <laughs> uh, on the hashtag fix me Lil Simsy. What was that noise you just heard? Hmm, okay, <laughs> things are going wrong already. Uh, but usually I would do a house that's like, you know, a, a fixer upper house, but I wanted to do Johnny Zest trailer because I just, I feel like he needed some help, okay? And I've been kind of going around and doing a lot of EA, like, base game houses and stuff, and I realized I would never get to Johnny's S because I'm doing them based on my Black Widow challenge, like, she'll marry a sim, uh, like, the land grabs, and then we'll go in and do the land grab house, or, like, the penthouse and Sam and Shuno, and then we'll go and do that, but we're never gonna marry Johnny's S in that challenge because he has no money, so, like, why would we live there, you know? And so I, I just, I wanted to help him. Okay, Johnny Zest has done a lot of bad things in his day. For example, ruined my one entire 100 baby challenge. Um, in case you didn't know, we had a baby with him and that baby is the heir. And so his genes have literally destroyed my baby challenge. Like it's ruined. So thank you Johnny Zest for that. But I just, you know what? He deserves a nice home, okay? And so I wanted to fix it. So I did that today. Um, and that's what I, I don't know. I, it's a little bit weird. It's out of my comfort zone because I, I did some weird furnishing because I felt like he's a, he's a weird guy. You know, and so I was, I was channeling my inner Stefo Sims when I was furnishing, not that her furnishing is weird. Oh God, this is a hole that I've done myself into. I mean, like, she does a little bit, like, more artsy things in her builds. Like, oh, she uses color more often than I do, and she is more creative in her furnishing than I am. And so I, I mean, I didn't do it well, but I tried. This is my Stefo Sims imitation, <laughs> except still not good enough. I'm just gonna keep trying to imitate Stefo Sims for a long time. Subscribe to Stefo Sims, her link is down below. You guys know she's one of my best friends, so I mean, I'm just gonna keep plugging her. Oh, this is, wait, hold on, because this is like basically every video for the past week. I'm like, hey guys, Stefo Sims, because she was, um, like I did the, on Saturday, I did that drawing YouTubers challenge she made, and then I did a collab with her on Sunday, and now here's Wednesday, and I'm like, hey guys, subscribe to Stefo Sims. <laughs> So in case you hadn't heard, uh, Stefo Sims, my friend, subscribe to her. I don't know why I'm doing this. I love you. you know what? I usually plug myself in these builds. I'm going to start plugging other people. Who else can I plug? Um, hmm. I'm trying to think of a good one that I haven't plugged recently because I just keep plugging the same people. Um, oh no. I'm just like, I don't know, Andrew Arcade, <laughs> my favorite streamer. Um, okay. 
Oh, you know what? This is okay. This is kind of a funny story, but I felt weird talking about it, but maybe I should because it's just kind of funny. Um, so somehow in my podcast, Steph was Sims when she was in my podcast, uh, Steph made some comment about my non-existent boyfriend. PSA, I don't have a boyfriend. And if I did, I, y- you know, it would be different situation, right? But she made some joke and people took it the wrong way because I don't have a boyfriend. And they're like, oh, your boyfriend. And so I got a lot of like Tumblr messages on my podcast Tumblr because like I you know, they were being creepy. And one of them was like, hey, Kayla, is Andrew Arcade the boyfriend that Steph mentioned? And it was so funny because one, Andrew Arcade is gay. (laughs) And two, like, what? How do you just assume that, because I have a, like, a streamer that I like that I'm dating that I, oh my god, it's so funny. So I had a good laugh from that. Um, Kayla, are you dating Andrew Arcade? (laughs) No. To answer your questions, no, I am not. Um, not exact. I, okay, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop. I just thought it was very funny. <laughs> so there's that. Also, PSA, not dating Steph either because shocker, you can have friends that you aren't dating. I know, wild, right? <laughs> the thing is, I haven't had any people just like because I don't really have any like guy YouTube friends. Do I? I mean, I do, but I don't have any like people that I'm like making videos because I've noticed that YouTubers when they make videos with people. People like to ship them, you know, but I don't have any like friends that I'm recording with a lot that are guys. And so people don't ever, you know, because when, for example, like, I don't know what's a good, I like back when Zoe and Alfie weren't dating, people like ship them already because they're like, oh, Zoe and Alfie, Zoella, mm, Zalfie, but they like, they weren't even dating at that point. Or maybe they didn't know, but like people just ship. That's what they do on YouTube is you ship. And so that doesn't really happen to me until now. (laughs) So there's that. Um, I don't know. I thought it was kind of funny. That's not why I wanted. To, that's not what I was going to do in this video. I I had a thing I wanted to talk about, but it has poof gone away. <laughs> so, oops. Um, I don't know. This is it's going wrong already. Oh, I wanted to talk about TwitchCon because I haven't mentioned that on my channel yet, which is kind of weird because like this is YouTube. Why am I talking about TwitchCon on YouTube? But I'm going to TwitchCon. It is like next week. Oh my god. I need. Oh my god. I'm not prepared for this. <laughs> but I am going to TwitchCon. So if you're going to TwitchCon, let me know. We can. We can find each other. I don't know what that, I don't know what I'm saying. Let me know. We can, I'll be there. (laughs) So I'm a little bit scared about it because I'm going to be, um, flying out. Cause usually when I go to California like this, cause it's happened a few times now, um, I'm like going specifically to meet like a certain person or like a group of people, or like I'm going to EA specifically, but this time I'm just going out there by myself. And like, I have friends that are going, but not any like close, close friends that are going. And so I'm a little bit nervous about it. Like just going to California alone, but I think I'll be okay. This is, um, this is going to be a time because <laughs> like before, you know, when I was going to say it, like go to EA, for example, for the first time, I was going to EA to stay at a hotel with every other simmer that was going to EA. And then we were going to be together the entire time. But like TwitchCon is TwitchCon. It's huge. And there's like lots of different hotels. I've got a lot of friends that are going, but like, I'm not going with them specifically. And so I'm a little bit nervous. Did I talk about this already? I don't remember. Oh my God. But I'm a little bit nervous about it. Um, but I feel like I've got some friends that are, I'll be okay. Um, and it's, it's a, it's a growing experience to just jet off to California alone again. Oh my God. This is what the third time, like, no, it's the second time this year, but like within like a year and a month, but no, wait, cause I was, no, cause I was in California this time last year, like this week last year, like the 13th or so, um, for Sims camp last year. And then I went to VidCon and I'm going back to, so I've been, wait, does that make four? Ha, huh. <laughs> four times to California in a year. That's the YouTube life, you guys. That's wild. I went from like barely ever traveling at all because I would just, my family just like went to Chicago every summer and Christmas. I would drive to Chicago to like jetting off to California all the time. Um, not even all the time. I mean, people go there way more often than I do, but like it's weird how just this year, this is like suddenly become very wildly different. Um, but yeah, speaking of Twitch, I keep plugging this, but I, um, I, I think it's a lot of fun. And so I feel like you deserve to know about it. I've been streaming a lot more. That's why I'm going to TwitchCon. I'm not just like a YouTuber going to TwitchCon. <laughs> I promise I stream. Uh, but my Twitch is linked down below. I stream every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. Um, if you wanted to, well, sometimes I skip Sundays if I'm like wildly busy, but, um, every Tuesday, Thursday, and most Sundays, and sometimes kind of randomly in there. I just, college is hard and busy and stuff, but Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday, I stream. And afterwards I put them up on YouTube, uh, on my second channel, More Simsy. So if you want to like watch any of these things, I have like all my past ones on YouTube. You can also watch them on Twitch too. 
but I found people watch them on YouTube a lot more often. Um, I think because I've got subscribers on that channel and like Twitch is kind of, I don't know. I usually watch like past streams on YouTube too, but they're all there if you want to see them. Um, I don't know. I just, I've been doing it a lot. I'm playing The Sims 3 every Thursday now, which is really fun. Uh, we're doing this thing called the Ugly, Di well, I kind of made it up, but it exists. It's like a prettacy challenge where basically you start with an ugly Sim and then try and like marry up and like the generations make them prettier. Um, so we're doing an ugly to beauty legacy as I have called it. Um, and it's just, it's a, it's a blast. It's so stupid and dumb, but it's, it's so much fun to play because we're just doing all kinds of crazy wild things. We have a dog named Goat, you know, like it's just, it's a good time. <laughs> and we're also doing the Disney princess challenge on Thursdays. And then on Sundays I kind of do random things. Like I played not so very for a while. Um, you know, just, we play Stardew Valley sometimes, not that much because I'm trying to get more into it, but like sometimes we play Stardew Valley. I don't know. I keep plugging these things, but I'm proud of my Twitch. It's fun. We have a cool community. I don't know. <laughs> Watch my streams. Um, but it's all linked if you want to check it out. But yeah, I'll be at TwitchCon. So if you're going, me too. I'm. Oh my god, the more I think about it, the more nervous I get because I'm just, I'm like jetting off to California alone. <laughs> I'll be okay, right? Promise, promise I'll be okay. I'll be fine. Try, I'll be fine. It's good. We're good. Like when I booked my tickets, I was like, yeah, I can do this. And like, the closer it gets, the more I'm like, wait a second. <laughs> hmm. Maybe I can't do this. <laughs> no, I can't. It's fine. Ha. I'm like looking at my calendar over there and it's got, it's like written on the board. You know, I have like a, like a whiteboard calendar, but it's like the month, you know, and it's written on the board from the 19th through the 23rd. And I'm looking at it and I'm like, oh my God, that's soon. <laughs> that's like next week. Ha. Okay. I need to do shopping still. I need to prepare myself mentally still. <laughs> I don't know what to expect still. I'm just, okay. It's fine. We're fine. We're fine. Again, if you're going and you want, and you've been, bef no, if you've been before and you can offer me some advice to panic less, that's cool. I, I can accept that. <laughs> if, if you travel, because the thing is, I fly alone all the time. It's, but like the traveling alone parts, I'm always going to meet people, you know, but the flying alone part scares me. Although when I went to Sims camp last year, I was really scared because I didn't know anybody that was going to be there. I mean, I had talked to like spring Sims before, but otherwise I didn't know any YouTubers and I hadn't met any before. And so going out to California for the first time then, that was scary. Um, but like since then, like, I don't know, I travel, it's fine. But it's just TwitchCon because I don't, I'm not like going to meet up with anybody specifically. You know what I mean? Like I'm not going to Sims camp to meet up with like these specific simmers. I'm like going and I know like some streamers, like I know a lot of people that are going actually, but like I, none of my like close, close, like best friend core group. I don't, you know what I mean? I'm doing a bad time explaining this, doing a bad time, having a hard time explaining this. I'm going to end the video now. Make sure to leave a like and comment and subscribe. This is bad and do all those fun YouTube things. And in case you guys didn't know, I post new videos every single day. And so I will see you all tomorrow. Bye everybody. I didn't even mess up that outro this time. I keep doing that. I don't know. I just, I can't even do my own outro. It's been two years and I still can't. It's a very simple outro too. I just can't say it for some reason sometimes. I don't know what my issue is. I mean, I have a lot of them, but this is like a main one, you know? <laughs> Simsy can't do outros.